candle pretty much sat under my nose right now is making me so happy hello everyone i hope you're all well oh my god i'm so excited to show you guys what i've got in front of me i have got pumpkin galore basically today's haul consists of candles and lots of them autumn mugs and a hell of a lot of pumpkin so my loves you already know the drill get yourself a drink fyi pumpkin spice is back at starbucks so best believe where i'm going to be going every single day for the next few months cozy light a candle get under the throws get some snacks i have been waiting all year to say that even though i've pretty much told you to get cozy throughout the whole of summer why is my voice going like that <laughs> so i'm gonna start with a favorite today which is fabric pumpkin how beautiful is it so i've been to home sense twice since they started getting autumn stock in and my biggest piece of advice is if you see it if you like it buy it because i actually noticed they had a bigger pumpkin selection like three weeks ago compared to now as you can see this is a beautiful pink fabric velvet sparkly pumpkin my aim for this autumn is to have a pumpkin in every single room so this pumpkin was 7 99 um i was kind of hoping for a white one like this so if anyone knows where i can get a white one i might just go to home sense like every single week to try and get my hands on one um because i feel like a white one would look really really nice in the living room i'm yet to find a home for everything that i've bought obviously because i've been keeping it in the bags to show you guys but I will let you know where I end up putting this. The next pumpkin I bought, I've literally been waiting to say that all year. The next pumpkin I bought is, oh my God, how pretty. Honestly, I feel like the camera doesn't pick up just how sparkly this is, but oh my God, it's so pretty. This is gonna look so, so nice in my living room. My living room's gray, white, and chrome. So I think this will just look really, really pretty on the coffee table. Another reason I had to pick this up as well is because I just felt like this is the dream pumpkin. Like it's silver, it's glittery. I, I just feel like it's the dream. This one annoyingly doesn't have a price. Um, but I feel like they're always usually around seven or eight pounds. They also had this one in a gold and a blush pink also as well. Okay, the last two pumpkins I picked up, I, I don't know if I really like these or I just picked them up because I really wanted to show you them. They look a little bit cobwebby, but then they also look a little bit marbly. And I did find these in the Halloween section, so I feel like they might be cobwebs. Um, but I picked them up purely to show you because I was hoping they would be marble. What are your thoughts on these ones? I'm very, very undecided. Um, I thought if you have like a grey and white home like me, something just fell out of it. What was that? They look like teeth. Maybe they're pumpkins filled with teeth. Oh, actually I think a little bit's just broken off there. Pumpkins filled with teeth. I mean, Home Sense do sell some crazy things, so I would not be surprised if these pumpkins were genuinely full of teeth as like a prank kind of pumpkin. To be honest, I think the reason that I bought these was because there was a mummy and a baby, and I'm a sucker for anything that's kind of like mummy and baby vibes. Like, I just think they're so cute. I love mini stuff, so anything that's mini is coming home with me. So the mummy one was 6 dollars and the baby was 3 dollars With these were, I could have these in the hallway. Um, I've got radiator covers in the hallway, so I thought I could stand them next to each other and then have a pumpkin spice candle burning in the middle. So then when people come into my house, the first thing they can smell is pumpkin spice and the first thing they can see is pumpkins. So I'm slowly just persuading everyone that it's autumn at the end of august so that is all the pumpkins i picked up like i said they do change their stock literally all the time um so if you see a pumpkin you like don't hesitate buy it it's all so you would have seen on my new in home sense last week that they didn't actually have any autumn mugs now the week before that when i went they had these mugs which i just felt like i could have cried when i found them because these are, I feel like when I've been dreaming of autumn mugs, because obviously like I dream about autumn mugs, when I've been visioning myself living my autumn best life, um, if you are new here, you are gonna think I'm mad. I am a little bit mad when it comes to autumn, but back to the story. You can just see me sat 
watching all the Harry Potters, the big hot chocolate with whipped cream and marshmallows in my hand in this mug. I just feel like in the UK, we really do not have many shops that sell much autumn decor. Like, I find when I see people in America, I've actually been to America, but when I go on Pinterest and I obsess over the beautiful porches with pumpkins and the map that says hello fall and just all of the gorgeous autumn decor, if you live in America, you just don't realise how lucky you are because I feel like... Things like this are a genuine like piece of gold. I feel like the UK supplies the best autumn goods, but when I found these cups, these remind me of just the beautiful big mugs that you see on Pinterest. I found these mugs, I got two, because of course I have to get two of everything, but I just felt like these are so big. I love how they're like a light orange. I love the pumpkin on the front. I love the little leaf on the side as well. Like these are genuinely like my dream mug. I just can't get over how amazing these are. Also, these were £3.99. £3.99 for the biggest, most autumnal mugs you've ever seen in your life. I just... I think like what a bargain as well. Okay, the rest of the cups aren't all to me, um, but I felt like they were cute. So the next two mugs that I picked up were just these plain little pink ones, um, and they've kind of got like a little ribbed effect on that. So these were two ninety nine each, and then the next one I picked up, which you guys would have seen in my new in home sense, was. I got this Peter Rabbit one for my mum, which I'm gonna go and give her today. Basically, whenever I see something Peter Rabbit, I always pick it up for my mum. Um, I used to love, love, love Peter Rabbit when I was younger, and whenever I see him, he just reminds me of my childhood, and me and mum love the film. So whenever I see something with Peter Rabbit on, I always pick it up for her. Um, and this is like a really cute little tin mug. This was £3.99. Yeah, I just think it's so cute, and I can't wait to give that to her today. And then, last but definitely not least, you guys will be happy to know, I picked up the cat mug. Because I just am a little bit obsessed with cats and mugs, as we can probably tell. And again, I loved just how big this was. Now, best believe I was in HomeSense pretty much on the floor, trying to look through all the syrups to see if they had anything pumpkin related. Um, but they haven't actually got anything yet. I say yet yeah, because they do usually have the syrups in a pumpkin spice, which are the nicest syrups in the whole world. I did find this one, which is iced cinnamon roll, and I just thought Christmas. Like, I really love these syrups because you can use them in so many different things. You can use them in hot chocolates, you can use them in coffees, you can also use them in like desserts. Maybe like an apple and cinnamon crumble, you could pop a little bit of this in there and it would just give it a little bit more flavour. Um, but these are also zero calories and zero sugar. I always wonder what these are kind of made out of when they have zero of everything in. Like, literally, it's zero, 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 zero. I'm like, what's in you? Like, how are you made? Okay, my loves, it's the moment we've all been waiting for, which is the candles, honestly. When I walked into HomeSense and I could just see this big selection of burnt oranges and just little pumpkin stickers, I just... I lost my shit a little bit, I'm not gonna lie. Like, I was so, so, so excited. So the first candle I picked up, I wanted just a really, really, really autumn-y candle that just looked like autumn in a jar, you know? Isn't it really weird how, like, a scent just instantly makes you feel a certain way? Like, honestly, this scent just instantly makes me feel cosy, makes me feel warm, makes me feel excited for the next few months. Like, it just... This is just happiness in a jar right here. So this was £5.99. Um, HomeSense had loads of autumn candles. Like they literally had so, so many. The next one I picked up was this Heritage Pumpkin one. These candles are all very, very similar, but I kind of like to go for ones that are a little bit more neutral because I find they really go with my home. As you guys know, my home is mainly like gray and white. So something like this stands out quite a bit. Um, so I kind of tend to go for ones that are a little bit more neutral. I know these are both pumpkin, well actually all of them are pumpkin, but they actually smell really really different. So this one smells more like a pumpkin pie, you know like that baking kind of smell. Whereas this one, this one is a lot more kind of like that artificial pumpkin smell that's like really really sweet, really cinnamony. Um, whereas this one smells like the real deal, like the real pumpkin. So this one says warm, spiced and sweet. Harvest pumpkin infused with brown sugar, ginger cinnamon, toasted clove, and sweet vanilla. Basically, this is 
um, heaven in a jar. Um, turns out I loved Heritage Pumpkin so much that I got two, which I didn't actually know. I feel like I would have got two on two different trips, um, but I'm actually really happy about that because that means I can have them on my TV unit and they'll match. So next I picked up this big boy, picked up the biggest candle ever, which is this. This is vanilla cinnamon. It looks so cute. I love the little acorn. I love like the nudie tones on the label. I love the lid. Oh my god, how cute. Actually, this one is genuinely as big as my face. And this one, it's a little bit more Christmassy, but I'm not mad at that, you know. So the next candle I picked up is pumpkin marshmallow. I've never seen this one before. I loved the gold lid and like the gold labeling. It literally smells like toasted marshmallows on an open fire. Like it's so, so nice. But then it also has a hint of cinnamon in there. I love like really, really sweet smelling candles. So this one was 5 dollars Actually, I forgot to tell you how much this big one was. This was 12 dollars which I actually think is an amazing price because that is a very, very big candle. And the last candle I got was this little mini one. I always pick up one of these every single year. I just love the mininess of it. Um, so this was 2 dollars and this one is pumpkin latte. Oh my God. This literally smells like I have a Starbucks pumpkin spice latte just sat right here. Oh. I picked up some macarons. Now, I actually never really knew I liked macarons until I had some the other week on this co-op I went to and they had like a fresh cake section, which I didn't even know co-op did, but they had freshly made macarons in there and they were like really big and they had loads of different flavors and oh my God, they were the nicest things ever. So I picked up these ones, which are apple pie flavor and I just thought they sounded amazing. I love anything cinnamony, anything apple pie, apple crumble with custard, oh my God. So were $2.99, they actually had loads and loads of flavors of these. They had chocolate ones, um, they had hazelnut ones, they had latte ones, like they had loads. I always think the food part of HomeSense is extremely underrated, like you can find such little gems there. And then I also picked up these ones which are just strawberry. So next I picked up just a plain photo frame. Next video you guys will see will be on Wednesday and it's gonna be one of your favorites which is a cozy day at home vlog and I've got loads of autumny things planned. And I've got loads more autumn decor which was kind of from Etsy, Amazon, like a selection of places. So if you would like to see more autumn decor then that will be included in the vlog on Wednesday. But basically I wanted just a plain kind of photo frame. This has just got like a chrome frame around it. It was $6.99 and I've got some cute little autumn prints to go in here which will look really really nice on the coffee table downstairs. Next of course I picked up a notebook because did you really go to HomeSense if you didn't pick up a notebook? I literally have a drawer of notebooks because I just always feel like I need a new one um, and there's nothing better than like a fresh notebook that you haven't wrote in yet. So this one's just like a really light marble. It has these gold bits on it. It was $7.99 and I love that this is quite big and it doesn't have dates in or anything. It's just lined and plain. And then last but definitely not least, I picked up two of these really beautiful big cushions. The other one is absolutely identical and these are actually gonna go on my sofa. These just feel such nice quality. Like the filling just feels really, really soft. I feel like they're choppable, which is amazing. It means I haven't got a refill them and these were $29.99 which is quite expensive for one cushion but these are absolutely huge and I love the pattern on these I love that you can also turn them around and just have this like velvety side as well so these are going to go on my sofa and I just feel like they're going to be so comfy Loves, that is going to go ahead and conclude today's video. I really, really, really hope you enjoyed it. I'm so incredibly happy to be filming autumn videos now. Um, I've pretty much planned everything up until January. So I've got all of my autumn Christmas videos planned. I've got some super exciting ones coming. So like I said, Wednesday's video will be a vlog which will include loads more autumn home decor um, and some nice baking. I'm excited to film that and then I have loads of cozy autumn routines planned, um, loads of hauls, loads of shopping trips. If there are any videos you would really like to see, please just comment them below and I shall get filming. But yeah, thank you so much for watching. Love you guys so much and I hope you're having the best weekend. Bye.